Good day friends, it is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another fun Tinkercad tutorial. So let's get cracking. Friends, this one's special to me. I have a friend that creates awesome cookies. She showed me this technique and I'm gonna share it with you, Miss Story. Thank you so much for the cool idea. If you're looking at the screen, friends, this is a gingerbread man. I'm gonna make this design public, but we're gonna do something different with it. I'm going to take the gingerbread man and I'm going to flip him like this. All right, everybody, let's have a ton of fun with this. First, put your work plane up on top and then we're going to turn this instead of a leg into an antler. Friends, grab your scribble and just draw little scribble antlers, something like that. When you hit done, we're going to make them thinner, make them white and then stretch them till they look just like we want on the design. And then we want two of these. So we're gonna use duplicate. I'm gonna use shift nudge, which is just shifting the arrow keys. And then we're gonna snag the sweet mirror command and we're gonna mirror it just like this. Friends, we're gonna take this and turn it into an awesome reindeer in just a couple easy steps. And it's so awesome, you can make them as custom as you want. Friends, while we're having fun with scribble, let's bring out another piece and turn these into ears with just a little scribble ear area. Once again, hit done, zoom out, use the little black handles to stretch it one direction at a time to get it to the exact size you want. I'm gonna then also make it white, like it's with white frosting, and just nudge it into place. When I'm happy with that one, I'm gonna do Control D this time once again, shift nudge to move it to the other side and let's mirror it so that it's aimed just like the first one. I'm gonna use scribble once again to make cute little eyebrows. Just make a little eyebrow piece like that. Hit done. Once again, set the thickness to four. I'm gonna make these a brown so they're on top. You can also fiddle with these and change the thickness to maybe give it a different shape. Once again, control D, shift nudge, and I'm gonna hit mirror so that it looks the opposite way. I'm gonna take these two and I'm gonna do shift select and I'm going to group them. And the nice thing about this is now I can hold down shift and click on the entire reindeer, click a line, and then find the exact middle so those eyebrows are right where I want them. Let's make eyes with the half sphere. I'm gonna shrink this down quite small. I'm gonna go size six. I'm gonna make it white. I'm gonna hit F to fit view. Okay, friends, now we wanna make the inside of the eye. So I'm gonna just do control D. I'm gonna do shift shrink till it says size two. I'm gonna make it black. Notice I am switching to the custom so I can make it really black. And then I'm gonna raise this up so it pokes out. That's not quite high enough, so I'm gonna raise it one more. That's pretty neat. I want these two pieces to be together, so I'm gonna hold shift and select them both. Notice it says two shapes, and I'm gonna tell them to be middle and middle. And then I'm gonna hit group. Notice they will turn to one color. We fix that by turning on the multicolor. I'm gonna zoom out, do control D, shift nudge, and move that to the other side till I am exactly happy. Friends, our reindeer is starting to come to life. I'm gonna quickly give him a nose with the half sphere. Once again, I'm gonna hold shift and shrink it until I am happy. I think that's gonna be pretty decent. And then I wanna put a big red nose on top of that so it looks like Rudolph. I'm gonna go back to presets and I'm gonna make that brown. And then I'm gonna bring out a sphere to that exact same spot. I'm gonna hold down shift and shrink that a little. I think size 10 is pretty good. And then we're gonna make that bright red so it looks like Rudolph's nose. And then if we hold down shift, we can align those. Once again, bing bing. I'm gonna do control up arrow to get it to the right height. When I'm happy, I'm gonna do alt shift and I'm gonna shrink it so it looks the right size as well. Now I can do control down and put it in place. Now I think the eyes and the Eyebrows need to be lower, so I'm going to move them down. And then I'm going to grab one last piece of scribble to give him an awesome scribble mouth. Let's give him a little smile. 
click done, move it into place. I'm going to choose that same four or maybe three millimeters. You can adjust that as you want. I'm going to give him a chocolate smile. All right, friends, so there you have it. An awesome way to make a cool little reindeer using an idea for making cookies. Thanks again, Mrs. Story, for sharing. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.